Hi guys, NCW here looking at MSC and USGS. And there has been a 5.1 earthquake in Southern California with 10 kilometers deep. That was followed by a 3.1 and a 3.6 and a 3.2 and a 2.7 and a 2.8. Um, looking at these, they all appear to have occurred in the same area. So we're going to do this first. I'm going to look at the seismic data that came in for this earthquake. You can see that it is listed 5 5.3, 5.3, 5.2, 5.1, 5.5, 5.0, 5.2, and 4.9. They went with 5.1, I guess, because it's in the middle. But we are going to go look at this one here for the 3.6, also listed as a 4.0. We're going to go look at where this earthquake shows that it occurred at on Google Earth. And then I'm going to do something else. So this earthquake is occurring over here in Ahai. I believe that's how it's pronounced. And this is within this area. Kind of looks like, I don't know if that's a house or maybe it's a house. I don't see a means to go and look. Um, let's back out a little bit. Can't go over in that area, but. That's where it's showing. It says Aspen, Gro Aspen Grove Ranch Breeding Incorporated. Anyway, it's Lion Creek. In this area, it looks like it's been burned. Maybe. Okay, so I'm going to do this real quick. And they've just had another one, which is a 2.2. I'm going to do a search for today. For California. And this shows the earthquakes for today. I want to export to KML. Properties, color style, share style, and yellow, K, um, do I have icons now? What icons? Where are my icons? Okay. All right. We can see where these earthquakes have struck today. They've been down in this area here. There's been more than what's showing on here, but as you can see, there's two here. These are close to the north frontal fault. And I half jokingly made a comment to a friend of mine today, and I said, I wonder how big the earthquake will be from the tropical system that's coming through. I didn't expect to see a 5.0. Anyway, this is Sierra Lakes, and this is the Fontana Fault here, and the Sierra Madre Fault Zone there. Or Cucamonga. Okay, so let's go look again. You can see we have a little bit of a swarm going on over here. So we have quite a few that are going on over here. You can see all of these ones in this area here. This is the Scissor Fault, the Lion Fault, Lion Canyon Fault, sorry, and the Mission Ridge Arroyo. Pen, parody, parada, 
Santa Anna fault. This one here is the San Cayetano fault. And then we have an earthquake up here, which is on the San Andreas fault. We have one hitting here, which is close to Clear Lake Volcano. And this is the Kaliami Fault. And then we had one up here, which is hitting the Keswick Fault. Anyways, I'm just showing you the earthquakes that have struck today and the swarm locations. This 5.0 is the biggest one that has hit today. 5.1 now. I would not be surprised if it is a foreshock. It's just something to keep an eye on, you guys. As I always say, be prepared. Have a plan. Um, let's look again on Google Earth as to exactly where this one hit for today. This one hit here where this swarm is going on, right there at this house. So when we back out, we can see a lot of earthquake activity has been going on here. So these three faults here have been very active today. And that has a 5.1 within that area. That is Oakview here. Okay, let's see what USGS has here. We'll refresh USGS, the 5.1, just there, 3.1, 3.6, 3.2, and they all say they're southeast of Ojai. California, I believe that's how it's pronounced, is O-J-A-I, 3.3 and the 3.2, whereas EMSC is showing that there has been another earthquake now, a 2.0. Anyways, you guys, I hope y'all are doing well. Um, let's see if there's been any news yet. Yes, there's been news. Uh, ABC San Francisco. That's October 22nd, so that's not it. Nine minutes ago, magnitude 5.0 earthquake shakes parts of Southern California. And it rattled parts of Southern California. CBS says a preliminary 5.1. ABC7 says 5.1. Oh, hi, California. This one's coming in from the patch, magnitude 5.1. And it was followed by several aftershocks. Anyways, you guys, hopefully there won't be anything bigger. And y'all have a great day. Much love. Oh. And uh, please keep an eye and ear out for the weather. I've been watching Reed Kemmer, and he is driving in California and is showing there is flooding. So please keep an ear out. If you're asked to evacuate, please do so. Thank you, and God bless you all.